What's up, guys? It's me, Trevor. Um, just uh, stopping by to uh, try out my first rendition here at uh, at a vlog series that I'm going to hope to uh, take um, and get going to talk kind of about um, my rehab program and, and how it progresses. Um, you know, I know a lot of you out there have have heard about Tommy John surgery, um, kind of have an idea of, of what it entails and, and how it, how it works. Um, but I thought it'd be not necessarily a fun thing to do, but, uh, uh an informative thing to do to maybe, uh, do a weekly video where I stop by, um, give some insight of what I've been doing, um, how I'm progressing in my program and maybe some other things that, uh, I'm doing physically and, and mentally to kind of, uh, to use this year to, uh, to take my, my, uh, myself to another level and, uh, become a little bit of a better player, um, you know, as I move forward here. So I don't really have a format yet, so I'm kind of just winging it. But for now, uh, I just kind of wanted to, uh, to stop by and say, kind of explain what happened. Um, obviously you can see that my arm is now in a 45 or sorry, a 90 degree angle, um, in a, in a, uh, in a hard brace. Um, that's so the, uh, the tendon can set. So what happens is you tear a small tendon, um, that acts as a seatbelt on your elbow, uh, keeps it from shifting too much when you throw a baseball. Sometimes it shifts too much and you get a tear in it. Um, the, a couple ways to do that or have it heal or to fix it or to have it heal itself or, um, go for a replacement. In my case, I had a full tear, um, and, and the, the location of it, what well, is just easiest and more uh, and better for me to recover from to just replace it. Um, so what they do is, and I'll do this, I'll show you really quick, is so they either go out of your wrist here. There's a tendon that a lot of people have in their wrist that you can replace. Unfortunately, I don't have it. So we had to go out of my knee here. So they took a tendon out of my knee that wraps around into my... Uh, hamstring and uh, replace it, replace my elbow with it. So, but fortunately, um, my uh, tear in my UCL was so clean that they were able to reattach the UCL and then also add the extra tendon. So technically, I have two UCLs, which I don't know but about you guys, but every time I hear about a super, superhero being made, that's kind of what happens. So, so uh, hopefully, uh, you know, uh, two UCL is UCLs is definitely better than zero, um, and uh, that'll help me in in some way moving forward here. Um, as for rehab and getting getting back on the mound, uh, that's not going to be for a few months out. But uh, our our next goal, uh, according to my uh, my team here, we're, that we're going to be uh, rehabbing with is uh, getting the inflammation out of my arm and also my knee. Um, so it's a lot of ice, um, like really light movement exercises, just keeping it, all the tissues moving and the blood pumping through it um, so that it heals. You know, I'm two days out. I'm already seeing a marked improvement in, in mobility and how I can move um, and just kind of just general pain when I'm sitting. Um, so things are progressing. I can already see it. Um, so uh, I'm here at spring training back in Florida. I'll be here till the end of spring. Um, and it's going to be just getting movement and getting uh, getting those things going. So as we move forward, and just so you know, as we move forward with these videos, um, I'm going to try to get bits and pieces, and when I can actually use my right arm, uh, edit them a little bit, um, bits and pieces of video from inside the training room, uh, from stuff I'm doing on my own to, to get my grip strength back, to, to get my full extension on my arm back, um, you know, uh, conditioning-wise, what I'm doing, uh, you know, I've added an element of meditation, which um, studies have shown not only I already do it and it helps me relax and, and stay focused on what I need to do, um, but also aid in the healing process by by um, helping your body relax and, and 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 send the healing to the parts of the body that needs it most. Uh, so these are all elements that I'm going to be including in future videos, um, like I said, once or twice a week. Um, but I just wanted to kind of hop on here, you know, try out this app, uh, new app on my computer to make sure everything looks good. All the audio is good. Um, and, uh, and really just start getting going on this, uh, on this YouTube journey too. Um, and maybe give you a little bit, a little bit more of an insight into something that you wouldn't uh, necessarily have uh, otherwise.
So uh, I hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to, uh, to hit the subscribe button and hit the uh, the little thumbs up on the bottom or thumbs down. I'll just take that as a you're you're sad for me. Um, either one, guys. Um, and don't forget to uh, to yeah to uh, stop by um, periodically, and uh, I'll be posting on the old Twitter, uh, TrevMay65, uh, on Instagram also, and on the Facebook. Thanks, guys, for being here, and uh, I will see you in the future.